Europa is a Jupiter's moon which was discovered in 1610 by Galileo. Its orbital distance from Jupiter is 670,900 km. It takes Europa 3 and a half hour days to orbit Jupiter. Europa is tightly locked, so the same side faces Jupiter at all times. If we talk about its size, then Europa is 3,100 km in diameter, making it smaller than Earth's moon but larger than Pluto. In late 2012, scientists used the Hubble Space Telescope and discovered large water plumps coming from inside Europa. A different research team after repeated attempts to confirm the observations saw apparent plumps again in 2014 and in 2016. The researchers cautioned that the plumps haven't yet been fully confirmed. but they provide a suggestion that there is water in europa's ocean which was getting out to the surface the reddish pink patches on the surface of the europa could be caused by frozen bits of bacteria but bacteria couldn't survive on europa's frozen surface so there might be liquid water inside europa's icy crust which is capable of supporting life the scientists said the bacteria could be blasted out if the surface in some kind of eruption and flash frozen further study showed that europa has oxygen in its environment ice crust on the surface and a very thin atmosphere under the icy sheet there are large oceans which contains two times more water than in the earth's ocean and perhaps there might be an alien life inside them the researchers at nasa says really what we're talking about is probably not dolphins or whales or lot ness monster down there but instead tiny microbes if europa is an environment where we think there should be life then it's important to know is there or for that matter if there's no life in europa's ocean and the conditions are favorable to life why not and how rare then is life as we know it on earth so that's all for this video thanks for watching see you next time